This, is... this stockpile of illegally poached ivory contains 105 tonnes of tusks from more than 8,000 elephants. The whole lot will be burnt this week in Nairobi as part of Africa's biggest ever mass ivory burning. It's a symbolic move to show traffickers that there's no place for poaching and the illegal trade must stop. It is important because Kenya is demonstrating practically that Kenya believes that the only value of ivory and the rhino horn is either on the elephant or the rhino. There is no other value and by destroying it we are um, walking the talk as it were. More than 30,000 elephants are killed for their tusks in Africa every year. Today, fewer than half a million roam the continent. Organizers hope the public burning will highlight the animal's plight and deter future buyers. Anybody seeing this kind of fire in a third world country, if you're in China, you're asking yourself, why are they destroying what looks like money? They're telling you, maybe it is, but to us, it has we want to put it beyond economic use. We don't want to discuss selling this stuff. It doesn't make sense to kill a seven-ton animal to make a cosmetic, make bangles, make a rubber stamp. It doesn't make you a special being. It is not medicine. The economic value of one elephant is estimated to be around $1.6 million through tourism, which means that throughout its lifetime, each animal generates 75 times the value of its ivory. For Kenya, which relies heavily on wildlife tourism, protecting its elephant population is a priority. Before the tusks are destroyed, scientists are examining each and every one to gather clues to combat poaching. Before they burn it, it's important that they know how much they have, what does it represent in terms of weight, in terms of pieces. Is there any other scientific information they can know from the ivory by taking a DNA record? So even after they dispose it, they have good data that they can use for scientific purposes. The ivory trade was banned under international law in 1989. Yet in China, one kilo of raw tusks sells for more than $1,000. Heads of state, international celebrities and conservationists are expected to attend the burning drawing attention to the elephant's plight before it's too late.